Not yet. Uh, the players are going to be coming back in in a little while uh, off of their break, so you know we'll meet them at that time, and we'll be sitting down with all the players over the next probably three days individually and just having some discussions, and we'll take it from there. Well, we want to get better every day. You know, we're going to work our process, and our process is based on, you know, this is a really important step for us, this information gathering. We want to make sure that we know exactly um, all the things that we need to about our players, about the staff, um, and then we'll, we'll put a plan together and start working the plan. But for us, that process and how we do it is the most important thing. I think if you do a diligent job with that, the results start looking after themselves. Um, and so we want to, you know, we want to, as I said, get better on a daily basis. We feel that if we can do that, we're, we're not that far out that we can't make up ground in order to uh, get above, you know, 10th place and then hopefully try to get into the top half of the league by the end. I'm not saying that that's going to happen, but I'm saying that, uh, you know, that's certainly what we're going to be working towards. And, and based on how we fit everything together, then uh, the results will show at the end. But uh, we're not worried about results. You know, we're more focused on the process. No, not like this, but the most important relationship is between the coach and the GM. So, you know, we'll be on the same page. We're going to talk about everything. Um, and, you know, there needs to be real good continuity there. Um, if the coach and the GM are disconnected, then things usually don't work. So, you know, I'm going to rely on John for a lot of things. He's got an intimate knowledge of the league and the players, not only in our team, but on other teams. Uh, the way that we want to approach things, you know, we will make those decisions together. Um, along with you know the rest of the coaching staff, and then along with the players. So, um, but that that connection between John and I is going to be huge. Uh, the fact that he's he's been a coach, I think, helps. Um, the fact that he knows Swiss hockey extremely well, that's even more helpful. So I feel like uh, a lot of necessary boxes are checked there in that relationship, and you know I'm looking forward to to moving ahead with him. You know, it's funny how much you watch. You know, so um, I've watched a lot of European hockey over the years. I've watched the Swiss League this year. I've watched the German League this year. Uh, not, you know, not having work or sorry, not working at the beginning of the season in the NHL. Um, I've done an awful lot of watching hockey, probably more than I have uh, in all leagues. So you want to know the players that are out there. You want to know and stay current on what sort of things are happening in the game. Um, but my knowledge, you know, Primarily, or what I'm going to start with is the knowledge of the people that, that are here, like John, like Peter Anderson. You know, having played in the league, coached in the league, he's he's going to bring in an, awful, an awful lot of valuable information. And then just doing the eye test myself. You know, as I said, I really at, at its heart, I believe hockey's hockey. You know, we're going to have to make a few tweaks based on the personnel that we have. But in terms of generally in the game, there's not going to be a lot of sweeping changes just because it's here in Switzerland or it's, you know, it's in Slovakia or it's in Germany or wherever it happens to be. Um, I think the game on a worldwide stage is is in a good spot right now. Everybody plays pretty similarly. You know, there's a few things that are different, but uh, that's the great thing about our game. And so we'll bring those. You know, we'll bring those things that have been successful in the game in other places here and we'll apply them. Uh, I just watched the last couple. You know, I, I think the one thing is I don't want to I don't want to make opinions, you know, with my own. I, I just wanted to get sort of a feeling for where they were at. So all the information I needed to, to gather about Lausanne, I, I could get by watching just a couple. I'm not really worried about what's happened up to this point in time. What's important is what's going to happen from today forward. And so for us, um, as I said, every player has a clean slate. Um, we're going to start establishing relationships with them from today forward. And I don't want there to be any sort of influence from what's gone on before. I'm going to base things on what I see moving forward from today.